Hi folks, Tom here again at the Fish Tank, and what we want to talk to you today about is the efficiency of buoyancy systems. And we're going to start with an air pump that comes up to a splitter, and we've adjusted that so that the air volume coming out is the same on either side. And what we're going to do is have a little race between standard buoyancy and with the Travis effect and see which one breaks the surface the first. That would be the system that overcomes the weight and delivers the, delivers the work to the surface of the water first. So, on this side, let's just review. We've got some new items here. There's a spacer in the bottom of the tank just to bring it up to the proper level. We've got some hardware sitting on top of our airline. That's just to hold it down. And we've got a notch cut in our one quart cup to be able to allow that to sit relatively flat. We've also got a one pound soft weight on top of there. On this side, the Travis effect, pinch this and try to lift the whole setup. We've got our traditional spacer that we've used, but we've drilled two holes in either side of it to allow the air to come out. And the air comes in through the notch in the side, same hardware, and uh, that air is then distributed underneath the cup. We have our same block and we have our same one pound weight. So again, what we're trying to do is see which one will overcome the weight and break the surface and show us that it is the more efficient system. So, let's turn on the air and see what's happening. On the Archimedes side, you can see immediately that it started to show the air in the top where the Travis effect collects in the bottom and then kind of bubbles up to the top. But we can see the air water line, because of the displacement of the block, drops very much quicker than we have over here on the Archimedes side. Come on, Archimedes, let's go. Let's make this an even race. But you can see the Travis effect side is actually moving up and it's about to break the surface of the water. So there we go. Travis effect has, has won the race and is the more efficient system. So what we can say with this particular demo is that you can see which side can vent and sink faster and then how does increasing the speed of the operation, the efficiency, with less input affect our output. It's great food for thought, guys. Really excited about the Travis effect. And we'll wait for Archimedes to go ahead and finish off before we close out the demo. Thanks again.